Praise the Lord. Good morning. Yes. A little snow. A little sugar on the ground from the Most High God. It's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. You all apologize. and You know who you are. I remember the first visit home uh, when I left basic, when I graduated from basic, basic training. And I went to my old neighborhood, the projects. All my friends uh, greeted me, my friends and family and people I had problems with in the streets. They were so happy to see me. I was in my BDUs. And the next day, I went to um, a dear friend of mine's grand grandfather's funeral and uh, class A's and friends and family and people I had pro problems with in the streets. And I visited Butler Terrace Projects, Mason Court Projects, Northwood Projects, Lincoln Projects, Edmonton Heights, Terry Heights, the old project, new project. I went to all my stumping grounds and Saw friends from Butler High School, Lee High School, Johnson High School, Grissom High School, Huntsville High School. And it was a wonderful visit. I was on leave from the United States Army active duty. And then I started seeing people that I knew I had wronged as a teen, as a, as a as an adolescent. I saw area business owners and teachers I gave hell to in the classroom and I started apologizing. One person, then a second person, then a third person, uh, Mr. Mr. Drake, Mr. Scott, um, this old man we call him Uncle Uncle. I used to throw rock set. <laughs> and he used to throw him back. Um, I found myself apologizing to people. I found myself clearing my conscience. I found myself apologizing to people from yesterday, from yesteryear. I found myself apologizing to those that I knew beyond a shadow of a truth. Facts change. Truth stays the same. I did that for, I think, four or five days, the whole time I was home, on leave. And and, and, and it was so refreshing and so conscious clearing and and I do that to this day. If I hurt your feelings, if I say something wrong, I do something wrong, and I know that I'm wrong, no facts, but truth, I will ring, I will grab you by the arm, the elbow, the shoulder, and I will say, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I'll try not to do that again. I apologize. I am wrong. I am the one that's wrong. You owe me no apologies. I did this. I said this. I started this. You see, because oftentimes people apologize to people just to get an apology from them. But when you wrong, you wrong. And watch this. And just because the person apologized to you, depending on how deep and how long and how awful the offense is, it don't mean you have to still deal with them. And that's what a lot of people think. Just because I say I'm sorry, uh, 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 they're going to still deal with me. No, sometimes you have to say I'm sorry and bye bye, do well, Ariba Dirchi, I'll be the same, uh, Groove Scott, <laughs> you know, and, and, and we have to apologize when you're wrong. Many leave out the house and go to work and destroy their loved one, their husband, their wife, their partner or partner, have to cover everybody, their baby mama, their baby daddy, fiance, shacker, shacky. Before you leave the house, you destroy that person, get in the car, go to work, get out your car. Yes, ma'am. No, ma'am. How you doing? Yes, sir. How you doing, sir? Praise the Lord, sir. Great day, sir. But just got to destroy your wife. Just got to knocking big and ugly holes in your husband. And nice to the security guard. Nice to the janitor. Uh, nice to the custodian. Uh, nice to the custodian engineer. Nice to the cook. Nice to the supervisor, the director, uh, but but you but you show your behind and raise hell and get in your car, roll rage, uh, cut off school buses and get to work. Yes, ma'am. No, ma'am. How you doing? <laughs> I like doing that as I leave this alone. So apologize when you're wrong, not if you're wrong. See, a lot of times people say if we're wrong. No, when you say if I'm wrong, that means you don't know when you're right or wrong, but you only know when you. Uh, been offended or when you write lower calibrate my senses calibrate my mind calibrate my heart show me when i'm wrong crush me when i'm wrong make me feel bad when i'm wrong well that's what i pray as i leave this alone when you're wrong you're wrong 
Call and apologize. Don't mean they're going to still deal with you. Don't mean they have to still deal with you. I'd rather apologize and get it off my plate than have it on my heart and mind for the rest of my life. And every time you see the person or think about the person, I wish I would apologize. I hope I didn't forget about it. I wish they apologized to me, but they ain't done nothing to you. When you're wrong, apologize. Clear the sleep. Clear your conscience. You can forgive and stay. You can forgive and go. You can not forgive and stay, or you can not forgive and go. I apologize, man. Turn back. Be a man. Not just in genitalia your age. Be a woman. Not just in genitalia your age. Be a man. Be a woman. Because of your mind and heart is calibrated of God. Be a man. Be a woman. And know when you're right. Know when you're wrong. And don't just know when you're right. But please know when you're wrong. Apologize. Say you're sorry. Please forgive me. I'll try not to do it again. Peace.